Hello, thank you for watching another one of my pivot stick figure tutorials. First I go to the pivot stick animator and show you a few extra stuff. And maybe how to make a guy who actually looks kind of better like a man. Not the realistic man, but I'm talking about one that we already that I already made. If you want to make like stuff like ninjas and and the warriors, you really need practice. First of all, the reason Pivot Stick has uh, the default stick man option is because it's, you can equip it. For example, just press edit while you select. Then, if you want a sword, you could just like on his hand, just press this. And then straight. That's a sword. And if you want a shield, you could just do this. And that's a shield. And then you can just save it here. I mean, already saved it. And then you can add it to your animation. You name it anything. So now I'll name it Warrior. And for example, another thing that I could edit. edit. If I, for example, if I want a fat guy, I could just do this. And then increase the, the fatness. And then then his, the rest of his body should also increase which makes him kinda like this it makes him pretty ugly but still fat pure flab that's, that's what matters we want this guy to be really fat he really has to like everything has to be kinda close to the same size you can't have a leg, a huge leg and a small a hand. So each side has to be the same. And there we have it. We have a, we have a small man who's really fat. Could also add here. So here, there we have it. We all, we then we add him and then we, we label him fat. And then we already have him. You can also make combinations, like you can see right now, he's on top of him and it looks like he's holding the shields and, and stuff. If you want, in order to make weapons, you just go create, and then instead of editing, you do new. For example, I want to make a pistol. Just go like this, like this. But the problem is you can't, it, you can only use line segments. If I want a pistol or a SMG or anything. Okay, for example, I'll do an, a, an a mini SMG. Or maybe even a pistol like this. But I'm still going for the mini SMG. See? <coughs> well, it doesn't look so much like an SMG, but you could like kind of edit it. Then just add it. Add it. We'll name it a uh, new name, and then we already have it like this, huge. Just decrease the just decrease the size into 30s. If you want, depends on the size you want. For example, we we'll make this guy hold it. Make him hold it. See, he's holding it, and then he can shoot or anything like it's freestyle. Next, I'll show you how to make stuff like arrows. Just since an arrow is mostly lines, there's no curved parts, so you can just make it straight, and then a triangle on top. For example, this could be the arrowhead. You just add it to your animation, and then, like for you, for example, you could turn it. But you also have to know how to turn it and which one does what, so it takes quite a pretty hard. You 
you get the idea. Here, we have an arrow, a guy shot the arrow, for example. If you want stu uh, other stuff, just go here, pretty easy. But, some stuff are very, very hard. Such as if you want to make so if you want to make a huge stuff, you really have to take the elephant instead of anything else and use it as you think. Since it's really really fast. If you want to make stuff like animals, you have to take it on a basis of these. So, for example, if you want to make something big, we'll just increase the size of the hands. We'll increase it. Okay, we'll delete the trunk. Maybe we don't if we if we don't want the trunk. We'll just delete the trunk. We'll delete it. We might delete the ear to not make it look like it. And then for example I could make a dinosaur. The dinosaurs, those long long necked ones. I'll also delete the tail because it makes it look like an elephant. And then make it bigger again. Make everything bigger. I might even I will I'll delete the head. Make it longer. And then Okay. Then, uh oh. Any time, like now, I made a mistake. You can just press X here, and it'll it will get deleted. So, right now, I want to make I want to make this thing. Well, for example, you can see that the neck looks kind of small. So you can you can extend the neck. If you want. So it's kind of easy. Here. Now we can make him, for example, if he's opening his mouth. Easy. Then if you want to save it so you can access it later, just go, go save and then write a name. For example, dinosaur. Then just press save and then add it to the, to, to the animation. And then you have it. You can you can do stuff. For example, eating uh, this guy e is eating him. So look, for example, his head. You close the head. You can make him bend his uh, neck, bend his head. You can actually make it kind of anything. The results are infinite. So, see now he looks like he's eating the arrow. You can make practically anything. Stay tuned for more tutorials from Taruka 999.